Good morning and happy Vlogmas Day 17. still hurts so we just went in the hot tub first thing and now it's time for coffee and I need to edit yesterday's video so let's see what day 17 will bring us Ooh, this is a good one gingerbread cookie coffee amazing just what I needed so I ended up falling asleep on the couch last night again and then we moved to bed fell back asleep and then Rita woke me up this morning wanting to be fed an hour earlier than she should have. Um, but anyways, yeah. So, went in the hot tub. The bottom half of my hair is soaked, so I don't know if I want to leave it down. I mean, I'm going to shower and wa probably wash it after my workout. Because I think we're going to go to the gym for a leg workout and use the sauna. After I edit my video and Sean's going to study for a little bit and then we will come back, fold some laundry, get ready for his work Christmas party. But first, let's make our coffee and then I'm so thirsty, I need to chug water as well. from the gym feeling sweaty um, I'm gonna shower and wash my hair in a minute but I wanted to get our lunch started since we did Domino's last night we're gonna do this HelloFresh for lunch um, and I think well no I'll just make it all probably and then shower I don't know I was gonna shower first you know what I'm gonna do that I'm gonna go quickly shower first and then I'm gonna start making this so BRB Freshly showered, letting my hair towel dry for a bit, and I've got my Christmas Bills crew neck on that my friend Kelly made me. Um, it's perfect for today for Sean's holiday party at his station, and it's also Bill Sunday, so got that on. And now it's time to make this spicy Peruvian chicken with loaded rice, pickled jalapeno, and creamy salsa verde. Let's get cooking. content because Sean pulled off a lemon from our little lemon tree by the pool. You remember when these were small and green and we were like, oh, these aren't lemons. What the heck are we growing? It. It's a huge lemon. Wash it. Cut it open. Right now? Yeah. Oh my gosh, it's all happening so fast. You want some lemon water? Sure. I'd love some. All right, so we've got the goodies in for the rice. And now I need to pour in the water, the chicken stock. And if I can find an opening. How's it look inside? Oh my gosh, it's a real lemon, you guys. Ah! Oh, it smells good. So we have two more on the tree 
And then I'm really hoping that like it grows more. And like that isn't it. So I've got the chicken in the air fryer. I pickled some jalapenos. We've got the crema sauce going. And then I just need to add everything together. The rice is cooking. So I'm gonna chop up these jalapenos and put them in here. And then it looks like once everything's done, I just put it all together. Yummy, yummy, all done. And they look good if I say so myself. Nice filling lunch after the gym. Food was delish. Now it's time to do my hair. I think what I'm gonna do is blow dry it um, in sections with my Dyson and maybe just do like the round brush. And then I want to do like a half up situation with this red bow. I think it would be really cute. So whether that'll work, I don't know. Oh gosh, my neck. Um, but that's my plan. So, let's do it. I guess it's not as cute as I thought. How come it looks cute on everyone else besides me? Explain that, please. Yeah, I mean, you look cute, but I just, I don't think it's the right bow. I mean, I can you cut might, it. You just look like you're, like, 10. Yeah, but it looks really cute on everybody else, so I don't get it. Looks like we're just gonna go with a little blowout because that was a huge fail. I'm looking to make sure that that little bit didn't leave a mark in my hair and it did not. So um, I'm in the process of like narrowing down an exact skincare routine that I love because I feel like I like bits and pieces of different brands so I need to just nail that down. But I am going to do this Kiehl's Retinol Skin Renewing Daily Microdose Serum. So I'm going to put just a little bit of that on. Maybe tonight when I get home, I will like narrow down the products that I like and try and use them all together and see if I can like nail down a set skincare routine. But, okay. Good. And then I'm just going to do a little bit of this Elemis um, Pro Collagen Cream SPF 30. Just like a little face moisturizer, you know? And then I think instead of doing like a full face of makeup, I'm just gonna do mascara with my skincare on and just call it a day because I just don't feel like putting makeup on my face to be honest with you guys. And um, this mascara that I use, oh, he took the towel. Um, is amazing to take off. So I've been using and loving the Thrive Cosmetics Mascara. My friend Julia put me on it, told me I need to get it. Um, as far as like the mascara look that it gives itself, like I would say is comparable to many other mascaras. But what's nice about it for me is that it's a tubing mascara. So it doesn't like 
get clumpy and shed and like streak down your face to take it off all i need is a hot wet washcloth like that is it and it comes off in tubes it's really cool so that's why i love it um i mean it makes my eyelashes look great but like there's other mascaras that i've tried that make my eyelashes look the same you know um but it's the whole taking it off thing which for me is huge because i don't like the feeling of makeup on my face at all and i don't feel like i'm wearing like a thick clumpy mascara with this and then it comes off so nice with literally just a wet washcloth so i'm not sitting there scrubbing like i do with other mascaras which is what i hate about mascara and makeup in general so I don't know. I've been thinking about getting a, like a lash lift in tint. Like I don't want eyelash extensions just because I feel like they're too high maintenance for me and I like to rub my eyes and like I don't like the feeling of stuff on my eyelashes and I feel like I would feel like I'm wearing false lashes all the time. I don't know. I've never had eyelash extensions but I know that they're pretty high maintenance and expensive. Um, so I've been thinking of just getting a lash lift in tint but I don't know if my natural lashes are even like long enough for that to like look like anything. I don't know. Okay. There she is. So I guess this is the final product and we still have like an hour before we need to leave. So I'm gonna go finish the laundry. I'll fold it a little bit later when it's um, all done. And then, sorry, I just noticed I like missed a spot on this eye. And then I'm gonna read my book, I think. So I think I told you guys in yesterday's vlog, I decided to do Iron Flame on audiobook on Libby and then um, read the Good Guide or Good Girl's Guide to Murder series next. Um, so that's what I'm gonna do. And then we'll leave for the party and i will try my best to vlog on my phone there i'm obviously like not gonna throw a camera in sean's co-worker's face <laughs> um but i'll at least try and vlog maybe like sean during the white elephant exchange or something like i'll do my best to get some clips if i can but here it is with just these two things and mascara and honestly i really like it so maybe we'll have to do that as like a daily routine type of thing uh my dyson i love it do not get me wrong however i can't get anything that i do with it to last like you know there's still some curl here from the blowout but all the other pieces have like already fallen flat and that happens even if i use the air wrap like curlers can't get it to stay at all to be honest with you i can't get my hair to hold a curl at all which is so wild because Growing up, I used to be able to have curls in my hair for like days at a time and they would still stay. So I don't know if it's just because I'm getting older or if my hair is getting thicker from like all the stuff I'm doing, which is great, but I can't hold a curl now. It's sad. I will say it feels very nice to be reading on my Kindle again. So I'm gonna go cuddle up on the couch and get to reading. What'd you get? Yeah. When I was, yeah. at, I was at Target, a little bit of bottle of liquor, a couple of bottles of liquor. Yes, do that too. Ready for the bar cabinet at home? A little scratch I off. Told her we, we were scratch them off. Scratch them off. Really hello, hello. I am back home from the Christmas party, and ignore the fact that this shirt's really wrinkled. I just went through and like found the rest of my Christmas PJs. This is from Old Navy as well. But I realized I didn't do my other advent calendar, so I'm gonna do my mom's gift card first. And we'll open the other ones. Um, it was really fun. It was nice to like meet everyone's families. Yes, Arby's. Um, it was nice to meet everyone's families and significant others from his station because I've met most of them, but not everyone. So that was really nice. Um, and then they did their little like white elephant thing. It was funny. A lot of them pretty much got like the same kind of thing for the gift exchange. So. That was kind of funny. Um, and then the food was really good and the bills won. So wins all around. Um, and now I'm back home in my PJs. And Sean is, he stayed there to work for somebody. They did like a shift swap, so. All right, this is Brilliant Fireworks, it's called. And it is like a, like a red, white, and blue 
glitter. You're probably not gonna be able to see. It pretty much looks like what is on the bottle. And then the YSL. But yeah, so I need to fold and put away the laundry. Um, I might edit this video right now, we'll see. Day 17, why don't I see it? Oh, it's right here. Ooh, what is this? Rouge, Ovar Rouge, Creme Essential, I don't know what this is. Let's see, it's like a little pot of something. Oh, it's, it's like a cream, like a lotion I think, like a face cream maybe? Neat. Um, anyways, yeah, so I need to fold and put away laundry. Maybe I will edit this video. I feel like it's been so boring today. Like, what did I do today that I vlogged? I really did not do much, honestly. Um, I will say, look, I came home and I looked at my hair and I was like, wait, there are like, not maybe curls, but like some good waves from the Dyson, I guess. Like some pieces have a little bit of curl. I don't know. I don't know, but um, I can show you guys taking off this mascara actually like not that you care but it is kind of neat to see because it's like a too big mascara you just like hold the warm water on my eyes and like wipe and it just wipes off <laughs> i guess it's really not that cool you guys are probably like mm, cool um but yeah i'm trying to think like what else i could even do i told you guys like i'm trying to nail down my skincare so it's not like i can do like my everyday nighttime skincare because I don't have like products set yet. Um, maybe I could go through my skincare though. Maybe, we'll see. I don't know if I feel like doing that to be completely honest <laughs> with you guys. Um, but we can chat about other things. Let's see, what can we talk about? I'll think while I fold laundry and then we'll come back. I just feel like this vlog is so boring. And I made a list of things I could talk about in a vlog, but they're all like things to do and not really like just things to talk about. Um, so far I'm liking the Good Girl's Guide to Murder book. I mean, I'm not that far through. I think I'm like 20%, not even of the way through the book or something. Maybe I'll read when I'm in bed if I have time after I fold laundry and edit, but I can't tell if it's like, I don't know. I need to like get farther into it for sure before I can f like form a real opinion about it. Um, but yeah, so I guess that's it. I'll stop rambling just for the sake of rambling and I will come back after I fold my laundry. I just realized, I thought it was the same as the last one, but no, this, this one says peace, love, and roast beef. I love Arby's marketing team and everything about that brand. <laughs> And vlogmas day 17 here I'm watching Noelle on Disney plus and I am going to head to bed here soon so thank you guys for watching and I'll be back tomorrow with another day of vlogmas bye